Good morning, welcome, thank you for joining me. I have to say good morning, even though it's four o'clock in the afternoon when I'm filming this, because if I say good afternoon, it sounds different and wrong. How bizarre is that? It's very strange, isn't it? I don't know why. I want to start out by saying this video is in no way sponsored or gifted or anything like that. It's just something that I wanted to share with you because it's a bloody good deal at the moment. <laughs> you know my love for Bath and Body Works candles and all of Bath and Body Works things, in fact. I recently shipped a great expense some candles all the way from America, and I'm very happy with them, I am too. Um, Goose Creek, which is what I'm talking about today, is a, another American brand of candle and Bath and Body products. Um, very similar, I would say, to Bath and Body Works in terms of both price and um, quality and the sort of vibe as well. However, the main difference is that they are much easier to get in this country. They have an EU site. I'm going to link it below for you. And at the moment, they have some absolutely bloody cracking offers on. I've just placed an order, which has arrived today. I only ordered it two days ago. So even though it's from, I think it's shipped from abroad, it comes really super quickly. Um, at the moment, they have got all of their Bath and Body products are... Two euros and 99 cents, so three euros. Um, I think they're usually around 12, something like that. So don't quote me on that, but it's a massive, massive saving anyway. They tend to go quite low in stock and they don't always have seasonal stock on. So I think they must buy in bulk out of season somehow. Um, so it, it, you're not going to get all the up to the minute sense, although all the bath, the, all of the. Um, ones I've got in this latest haul have been current, but I noticed that the candles they have on the side currently, they haven't got a great huge selection of candles, but they are a very good price. They're 12 euros 99. Um, I didn't order any candles this time because frankly, if I order any more candles, Mr. Matthews is probably going to divorce me currently. <laughs> no, he's not really. I kid, I kid. However much you order, shipping is around five or six, five euros 95, I'm thinking five seventy five. So again, very reasonable considering it's coming from somewhere in Europe. So without further ado, let me show you what I purchased and then I'm going to share. I've got a few candles that I've ordered from them previously just to give you an idea of the type of candles they do, if that's what floats your boat. Um, I'm going to start with hand soaps now they do that i actually prefer with them um, hand soaps i prefer the creamy ones but they only do um the foaming ones so i've had to make do with the foaming ones but that's okay and the first one i got is in watermelon lemonade i love the packaging i love all the pictures on them i think they're so nice they're they're so i don't know i feel like we don't have anything like their packaging in this country and I don't know why I feel like that, but it just, I feel like it's very American. I quite like the vibe of it. I don't know why. But yeah, watermelon lemonade, which as you know, if you watch my videos regularly, watermelon lemonade is my first ever and favourite Bath and Body Works scent. And I didn't know that um, Goose Creek did it as well. This actually smells very, very similar to the Bath and Body Works one. I guess it would. Slightly less sweet and slightly more watermelony, I would say but very, very lovely. Um, the other hand soap I bought is in Pineapple Cake Pop. Look at that, just look at that pretty packaging. This is like a pineapple-y, vanilla-y, cakey scent. I would say more cakey than pineapple-y, that one, but very fresh and nice. Right, let's move on. God, I've got that all over my hand. Let's move on to the hand creams. I bought four hand creams and, oh my goodness, the loveliness of these things. Can I cannot tell you. I got a watermelon lemonade to match in with the um, hand soap. Um, I then got Island Bliss. Just look at that. Anything that looks like a holiday at the moment, I'm just all over. I just, I'm just very attracted to holiday-ish looking things of all descriptions, which I don't know what the scent is. Oh, it does, does tell me the fragrance, the scent, sorry, it tells me the fragrance notes. This one is mandarin orange, amber, sandalwood, and coconut. I'm not gonna smell them all because frankly, you probably do want to watch me smelling smelly things. 
that that is very nice indeed. I then got pina colada because again, that holiday vibe. Oh, I've, I've already smelled this one and it just, it smells like putting a pina colada all over your hands. What's not to like? I mean, what is not to like? This is glorious. This is blood orange. Um, oh, I should probably tell you the fragrance notes in pina colada. I guess you know them anyway. Pineapple, no shit. Coconut, no shit. Milky vanilla sugar, yum. Yum, yum, yum. Blood orange one, fragrance notes are blood orange zest, orange peel, cool rain and sandalwood. I have no idea what cool rain smells like, but it's nice, I can tell you that. And yeah, that's the four hand creams. And then I got five, five body creams. I get through a lot of body cream. I have very dry skin on my body. And I put body cream all over my body at least once a day, sometimes twice, depending. Now, these are in this sort of packaging. The first one is the Blood Orange to match with the Blood Orange hand cream. Thumbnail right there. <laughs> um, and I also got a Pina Colada to match the Pina Colada hand cream. And I also got a Watermelon Lemonade to match the Watermelon le Lemonade soap and the Watermelon Lemonade hand cream. The full set there. Um, that would make a nice gift as well, wouldn't it? And that's nine euros, so like seven pounds-ish, seven pound fifty for a lovely set that you can't get in this country. That's, um, yeah, that's a really nice idea, isn't it? And then I got two other sort of standalone ones. Look at that again. It's got that holiday vibe about it. This is what I'm all about, isn't it, at the moment? Fresh coconut, moonbeams. Smells of moonbeams. How nice is that? High tide, warm musk and dark woods. Let's have a smell of that one. Moonlit coconut. Oh, that's nice. That's less girly, that one. It's quite um, heady. Just imagine that on a tropical beach at night, you know, when you can get all the, the smells of the um, jasmine and everything come out. Oh, lovely. And then finally, a very sweet girly one. This is cotton candy. Haven't smelt this one. Let's see what this smells like. Oh, that's sweet. Having said I wasn't going to smell them all, I have just literally smelt them all, haven't I? Fragrance notes in that are cotton candy, sweet sponge sugar, blue raspberry and strawberry. Yummy. Right, that is my haul. I actually had, I won't lie to you, I had way more than that in my basket and I had to have a strict word with myself saying really don't need any and they had quite a lot of christmas um wintry christmas scents in the 2.99 sale as well and i really i had a lot of the christmasy ones and thinking that oh, wasn't they're only 2.99 that's such a bargain i'm gonna get them now ready for christmas but i managed to restrain myself i did rein myself in although <sighs> You never know, I might be placing another one. No, I'm not. I won't. I won't. I won't. Right, let me show you some candles that I've bought from the previous. I may have shown you these candles before. I don't know. Um, the first one is Melon Picnic. They're, as I said, very like the Bath and Body Works candles. I'll, they do jar candles as well, but I li really like these three wick ones. I think they're um, my favourites in terms of they don't get... If I were jar candles, they're deeper than this. and you get all the, if, Unless you've got the long lighters, I have got the long lighters, but if you haven't got them, they're really difficult to light when they get down to the bottom. This is Melon Picnic. The fragrance notes in this are... It doesn't tell me. Why does it not tell me? Why does it not tell me that? It's melon anyway. Melon on a picnic. Um, it's very nice. I like it. I'm burning it at the moment. Not, not this very second, but that has been burned... Over the last couple of days, I've had that a light in the mornings. It's quite a nice morning -y scent, that one. This is gorgeous. This is brown sugar churros. What's not to like? This makes me crave sweet things. If you like a baking scent, that's a nice one. I definitely have talked about these before because I remember talking about this on camera. It's a fragrance called Cozy Kitten. <laughs> I don't know 
why I just it amused me that there was a fragranced candle in the fragrance of cozy kitten because to me cats don't smell that nice generally I mean they don't smell unpleasant but I wouldn't think oh I love the smell of cat would you it smells sort of god I'm hopeless at describing it I'd say that's sort of woody. That's a woody sort of scent. It's not going to help me out because it doesn't say on these what the fragrance um, notes are. I don't know why it doesn't say it on the candle. That's odd. And then finally, I've got fried apple sugar. Um, I haven't lit this one yet. But that smells fresh. That's really apple-y. That's sort of um, apple pie-ish. Yeah, that, that one's nice and fresh without being too overly sweet. Yeah, nice and apple -y. I would say that's more of a crunchy apple than a really sweet apple, which is nice. I've banged on for 11 minutes now, over 11 minutes, about candles and American bath and body products. What's not to like? What a fantastic video. I enjoy making it anyway. I will link the website in case you want to buy anything. Again, just to be clear, absolutely not sponsored. It's just a really good deal for these things at the moment. And if you're into this sort of thing, I thought you might like to go and have a look and um, see what I bought from them. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.